good. Um, reason why I'm going live is that uh, Nokia just uh, came out with uh, with an announcement today. Uh, I actually wanted to follow it live, but uh, unfortunately my call lasted uh, longer than I thought, so um, couldn't uh, talk about it live. Okay, perfect. The, au the audio is so much better. I'm like so much happier with this setup, <laughs> with this new Lenovo device and this microphone and everything. So um, I also became a bit better at um, basically, uh, I'm just figure out where to put the camera because I know I should be looking in there but uh, let's see how this is gonna work I wanna go straight to the announcement I mean first of all I worked at Nokia for seven years I joined in 2007 uh, with a leadership program where I was relocating from the headquarters in Espo Finland to uh, Ulm in, in the southern part of Germany and then uh, China uh, in Beijing in 2008 during the Olympics, that was so much fun. Back to Finland, northern part, Oulu, freezing my butt off, but it was fun as hell. And then I ended up in San Diego, uh, in California. I was there for about eight years, uh, five of which with Nokia and a bit of Microsoft. So I'm still a huge Nokia fan. Uh, I will say this once again that I've been unfortunately buying uh, just a Xiaomi device. So I got a couple of uh, this uh, uh, Xiaomi Mi A3, which are two. Um, uh, which are both Android One devices, because I I do under I do believe and and I do agree with Nokia's vision of uh, kind of coming up, coming up with um, Android One devices. Uh, but but you know basically uh, I just thought that um, I tried to buy Nokia devices online and I couldn't manage a couple of times you know the, like just issues and I even reached out to a lot of people HMD and just nothing happened. It's <sighs> I might see a little bit of that uh, kind of uh, too big of a corporate culture got stuck into HMD because you know, if I was just some guy, they'd just be like, man, we are little, we're growing, we need like all the help that we can get. Um, I'm still looking, I'm still interested in two devices. So I actually want to watch the uh, streaming together and uh, and see. So there, I think they're now the 8.3 5G device is finally going to go live and global by the way it was like i don't know if it's a youtube issue or if it's my connection my connection is like damn good actually uh i'm probably gonna just uh, refresh the page i was noticing the same thing happening before so so h 8.3 5g should be launching maybe maybe my device wants me to uh, close down some windows and i will Okay, and then HMD, the home of Nokia phones, in the year is is in year four. Our smart our Nokia smartphone come with three years of monthly security updates, which is great. In 2020, we have received two trust awards from Economic Times, India, and Forbes. Definitely trust the Nokia folks. No, Nokia phones is number one worldwide in feature phones. Yeah, that's not Hello and welcome to you all. I'm joining you from the famed Pinewood Studios, just outside of London. Why I have a just so you know, I'm streaming this from a 64 uh, gigabytes uh, brand new Lenovo device, so there should not be all this lag. But what I'll do is that I'll 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 help uh, my device out. Why? Okay. Yeah, it still is just taking too much time to load. It could be a YouTube issue, to be honest. It's really strange. I'm gonna try to restart once again. We watched this already. Let's uh, hear it from Florian. Hopefully. Uh, I actually wanted to get some work done while I was watching it and commenting it, so... I'm not very happy about having to close the window. I'll probably just use my other laptop. Just outside of London, which is where the upcoming 25th James Bond film, No Time to okay, Die, was filmed. But before I tell you more about why we are on set here today, and before we share the incredible lineup of product innovations we have in store for you, I wanted to take a moment to reflect on where this year has taken us. We last spoke six months ago 
And in that short amount of time, we are all living in this very new world together. Isolation and vulnerability are real, meaning that the way we are working and living has transformed. I think we all quickly realized the importance of technology and having a reliable and trusted phone in navigating these uncertain times. Now more than ever, it is important to stay connected and to look out for one another. I've been very touched by initiatives that were driven by HMV employees during lockdown who donated phones to local hospitals to support COVID-19 patients, people in risk groups, the elderly, schools and charity. That's very nice. Love how Nokia is keeping. As the world moves increasingly online, we pride ourselves in creating devices that have the latest security and software updates. We were recently named a leader in security updates and appeared on the most trusted brand list in the Economic Times. Over the last few months, we've seen a solid recovery of our business momentum and we achieved some great milestones. We launched three new, much-loved phones globally, the Nokia 5.3, Nokia 1.3 and the reimagined Nokia 5310. We launched our new C-series, the Nokia C1 and Nokia C2, which are designed to bring the smartphone experience to emerging markets at an affordable price. Here, we've seen very strong success, especially in Africa, where the C-series became the number one selling device with several of our retail partners. We've also secured a $230 million investment from our key strategic Congrats partners, on that. Which is Good an to have Qualcomm and Google. Absolutely. And today, uh, I'm good very excited that. to announce that we are launching HMD Connect Pro, which offers businesses the chance to take advantage of our brand new global data roaming service. HMD Connect Pro enables enterprises to buy and manage data connectivity based on their needs locally or internationally in more than 160 countries, creating a global SIM that can be centrally managed across all universal devices. The main advantage of HMD Connect Pro is the ability to provide maximum flexibility for each business to tailor to their needs and to manage their devices in a very simple way without large commitments. Now on to today's events. I'm very pleased to announce that I'm standing here at Pinewood Studios at a shoot for our first truly global 5G smartphone, the incredible Nokia 8.3 5G, which is available to buy and pre-order as of today in countries around the world. The Nokia 8.3 5G has the ability to capture cinematic style video and photography, which is perfect for the social media savvy. Before I introduce our next guest, we want you to listen now Definitely for excited a feature about the 5G of device. the new devices I'll that you think out. would suit a double O agent. Give your answers in the comments below and you could be in with a chance of winning a Nokia 8.3 okay, That's 5G. kind of a weird, On weird, that a weird note, question. I would like to hand over to British content creator I'm not sure why ben the McLean, UK website, a the man whose website passion is video and photography, to show you the Nokia 8.3 5G in action. So we're here today at Pinewood Studios, attempting the most epic photo shoot ever taken on a smartphone on the Nokia 8.3 5G. Uh, we were here at this amazing set with Lashana Lynch from the new James Bond movie, No Time to Die. And it was hectic, but the shots were epic. So yeah, look out for them.
Thank you, Ben. Welcome, everyone, and greetings from sunny San Diego. We're shaking up the 5G smartphone space with a market-leading product that beats its affordable flagship competition on aging innovation, innovation that bet you ha. Design. I was working As together with this guy in San Diego. I love, I love his Finnish me, accent. It's like, I love Finnish accents in general. Like, it's pretty strong. Like, I love is its uncompromised 5G experience that it yeah, offers to everyone. Nokia. You can download and share your content faster I want to get this device. I mean, I'm going to buy it. In fact, our field test the website finally works. Reaching up to 15 and I was seeing this speed. before. That's amazing. I'm, I'm, speed test is one of the things I make everybody do all the time. <laughs> like, we have been on a mission to deliver the very best experiences to everyone around the world. Building on our strong heritage of reliability, we are completely committed to delivering products with all the quality and reassurance you would expect from a Nokia phone. This is just one of the reasons why we're seen as a brand that people trust. That trust is founded on three core pillars. It's about uh, building on our trust, 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 reliable. sure, guys. It's, it's about gotta get our that website to work well. Everything that we uh, do. You should own the e-commerce stack. You shouldn't give it up to some other third company. To be honest. Premium Nordic designs That's what I would do. With the very best of no, even me, I'm Always trying to buy it, and I just couldn't and buy it. You know. That's, and these core values fixed. are becoming increasingly appropriate for today's client. As our business evolves, our commitment to transparency becomes even more important so that you know with absolute certainty that any product or service from the people behind Nokia phones is truly secure and up to date. As the only major phone manufacturer founded in Europe, we adhere to some of the strictest data privacy rules to ensure that what you share with us is protected and respected. That's good. Our data storage Price is focus is definitely very feed. important. And we are fully transparent about what happens there, which ultimately is about ensuring your phone experience is the best it can possibly be. Our Finnish heritage means that quality and reliability are in our DNA. Staying true to our roots, we follow some of the toughest standard product requirements in the industry. We demand more from our Nokia phones, which means that you can expect more from us. Our values in today's world have never been more relevant. It's no secret that consumers around the world have become more mindful about their spending and are opting for less expensive, more sustainable products from brands they know and trust. It's therefore more crucial than ever that our products stand the test of time, especially in the affordable sector. That's why today, I'm delighted to announce our first new product. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to introduce to you a phone that is sure to be a fan favorite. The new Nokia 2.4. Since I guess since it's 2.4, it's probably like a pretty uh, entry-level device. Wow, 6.5 inches camera, 111 ready, two-day battery life, fingerprint reader, bigger, smarter, yours. Retailing at just 119 euros, the Nokia Tutor 4 offers exceptional quality and performance. It's crazy. With adaptive battery and AI imaging, the Nokia Tutor 4 is a perfect companion. Nokia Tutor 4. Easy to unlock with a fingerprint or just a glance, its 6.5 inch HD plus screen uses the cinematic 21 by 9 format, so you can carry the big screen with you wherever you go. The camera provides the flexibility of a dual setup, a main camera and a depth sensor. AI camera functionality like dedicated night mode and the ability to take portraits with shapes in the background blur and edit them in post capture are both being introduced to a Nokia 2 series device for the first time. The Nokia 2.4 is ready for Android 11 and beyond, so you always get to experience the latest Android innovation. And its 3D nanotexture cover will keep it in great shape for much longer. Always inspired by our Finnish roots, with this latest addition, we are introducing a fresh color palette to the portfolio through new earthy tones in a stunning gradient finish, taking our design another step closer to home. Seems like the, the Nokia 2.4 will be available in charcoal, 
a beautiful shade with a subtle golden tint. Fjord, in need of all Nordic shades of cyan blue to purple, and finally dust. Inspired by the Finnish sky in spring, it's a beautiful shade that represents the dust sky. Show me, show me the phone. Which one is it? feelings of calm and serenity. Enough, you hope, even if even if it's a pretty guy. With modern features and stunning design in a more accessible Android-powered future-proof package, Cameraman? the Nokia Give us the phone. is perfect for those seeking an affordable, long-lasting purchase. Now on to something for those who need a little bit more, from imaging capabilities to performance. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce the highly anticipated, performance-packed new Nokia 3.4. 3.4. I wonder if the android.com slash one is already updated with this, not yet, so, in really next phones are gonna be Nokia's, I guess, 6.39, more power, Qualcomm Snapdragon, today battery life. Like they keep the Nokia 3.4 brings an incredible new level of performance to the Nokia 3 series. Using the latest Qualcomm Snapdragon 460 mobile platform, it provides a 70% performance upgrade compared to previous generations, but without a price hike at just 159 euros. Smarter, more intuitive on-device interactions that respond to you and your environment, like intelligent photo capture and better voice assistant to accomplish your daily tasks. The triple camera with AI imaging Actually, gives you the just perfect realized shot every that. time, whether it's in portrait, night mode, or using the ultra-wide camera. The 6.39-inch oh, HD Plus Polaroid display gives you screen, even so more screen space for you to enjoy your favorite the content. The Nokia 3.4 out. also comes with the Android One Pro. From the no from my flutter, computer, no blower, so it doesn't create any echo. Just pure Android performance. <sighs> Much better. This is the first time we have a hole-in display and yeah, well, a triple camera a, a Neko, in Nokia so 3 perfect. series. Again, we're trying to cram as much technology and innovation into a value price point than ever before. And this is by far the most powerful Nokia 3 or even Nokia 4 series phone we've ever made. Reflecting our fresh new color palette, with dazzling finish, I like to call living colors, the Nokia 3.4 will be available in charcoal, which shimmers with subtle golden tint. Fjord, which in our living colors finish, appears to reflect like those shades of cyan like blue to purple. I'm outside, now I'm not and of course the, company, the beautiful so deep purples like hard for me to keep and track golden of reds series. of dusk. What's even more exciting Making is that you don't have to wait long. The Nokia like 2.4 will be available this month, of course, when you're inside, and the Nokia 3.4 from early October. All these different devices. Our commitment to delivering premium experiences at truly accessible price points extends beyond phones. And with the same quality you would expect from a Nokia phone, I'm delighted to introduce to you our new range of accessories I love that not only finish bring I love exceptional Finland. functionality I can't wait to get back to in a familiar it's design a that our fans know and love, but also perfectly complement the new Nokia 2.4 okay, and Nokia 3.4. Like, yeah. Following the success of Nokia Power Earbuds, which some reviewers called a hidden gem, offering great audio quality and an amazing battery life, I'm pleased to introduce the Nokia Earbuds Lite. Actually, I can... Perfect. Oh, great. I can listen to the audio here. Directly. So, I'm actually looking for some good headset. Like, the, basically, the... Actually, the... Uh, the travel AirPods Pro don't work well with Android, not even PC. Of playtime, so you'll never need to worry about them running out of juice. Rated IPX7, they're also waterproof for up to 30 minutes in one meter of water, so you don't need to worry about being caught in the rain. As ever, inspired by our Finnish roots and designed to perfectly complement our, our smartphone portfolio, the Nokia Power Earbuds are available in two new colors, Polar Night and Mint, and they will both be available in October. And now, for the first time in our accessory range, 
we're introducing the Nokia Portable Wireless Speaker, a oh. brilliant new product. Its design makes it truly portable, and it I'm provides really up small. to four hours of wireless playtime. Looks interesting. It has an integrated microphone so that you can make calls hands-free. Perfect as a speakerphone when you're working from home. And by linking two speakers together, you can enjoy high-quality stereo sound. Oh. I open... Yeah, yeah, so it's basically if I open up another Chrome... And just like all of our audio devices, about that. it comes with the universal Bluetooth 5.0 compatibility, so you can connect to any device. The Nokia wireless speaker will be available in November. We know Nokia is renowned for going the distance, so you don't need any extra protection. But with the beautiful new looks we've revealed today, you might want to play it extra safe. And so, we're also introducing a new range of cases that feature air bubbles for added protection, the perfect fit for your new Nokia phone. A clear case that doesn't hide the stunning finish for your Nokia 2.4, 3.4, and the new Nokia 8.3 5G, offering increased impact protection and enhanced handling. The Nokia Entertainment Flip Cover, a vegan leather cover with stand functionality so that you can binge watch your favorite shows hands-free. And that's it for me. Two new phones packed with awesome features at a great price. All wrapped in a quality finish you know you can rely on. And a brand new range of accessories that complete the experience. We have more news to come before the year is out. So I'll be seeing you again very soon. But before I go, I will hand it back to Florian, who is joined by a very special guest in Pinewood Studios. Thank you, Yuho. And now I'm joined by a fan who fell in love with her Nokia phone when shooting with it on set in the upcoming film, No Time to Die. Ladies and gentlemen, the extremely talented Lashana Lynch. I am here at Pinewood Studios with Nokia phones and Ben McLean having an absolutely wicked time taking some amazing pictures on the Nokia 8.35 G. I've been lucky enough to visit some incredible places in my life, so always snapping away using my phone, taking pictures, and I'm basically here today to give Ben a run for his money. Check out our amazing pictures from this shoot out today, and I will see you all in November for the release of No Time To Die. Thank you, Lashana, and to all those who have watched at home. To recap, we have two incredible new devices, HMD Connect Pro for business. I would have a number of new done something with some developers. And the arrival of the um. Nokia 8.3 5G. And there's still much more to come for 2020. I'm sure there is. Thank you. So I would say probably yeah, the, the most interesting part of the announcement was obviously for me the, the, the 5G device uh, for sure. Um, I watched recently I watched the Apple announcement for you know the one that they had right now in November of course I watched all of the Apple announcements so like they had the I actually want to check one thing with my lighting so just give me one second um, but so I have to say, obviously, it's hard to match Apple. I mean, compared to Apple, for me, as a consumer, right, I'm try I can, as a Nokia guy, yeah, it's an amazing announcement. And I am excited about the, the, then I need to transition to a consumer aspect, right? I'm trying to have, use all the devices and trying to get back to my normal, uh, without, you know, without having biases kind of uh, approach. And, um, well, first of all, in the way, especially in the way that, I mean, it's of course super hard to match Apple with all their kind of incredible, I mean, they we're talking about two different companies, like right now HMD is like a little, a little startup, basically. Uh, it is what it is, right? And uh, it, it's hard for me to kind of um, admit that because I joined Nokia when Nokia was like the biggest one and now this is like a totally different company. So I, I need to step back my approach, but still, even as a small startup, uh, we can definitely improve it. I mean, Yuho was in San Diego, you know, we worked there together. I would have 
just just get a little drawn out are you do we even have is there even enough i keep saying we because i still feel like <laughs> nokia my nokia blue blood will run forever um nokia was too good to me and i'll never forget that um but um what should i say yeah like even just showing like a little drone action which is like you know you can do that for like real cheap because that you know right now it's really like a technology that has been it's like commoditized basically uh so just even even just something like that that would have been super epic uh and there was like a little bit too much focus on on you or on florian the whole time so like at some point you know they were showing me the colors of the device like show me the colors you know don't 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 show me so there was like about how the event was done but then let's let, let's go straight to the to the devices i mean soup of course super excited about the uh nokia 5g device you know i really can't wait to to buy that i'm gonna i'm gonna buy it like literally right now um it, i definitely want to have a 5g phone like right away i really like the device looks super good i'm not sure about this like no time to die whether that at least from my perspective it doesn't really kind of <laughs> make me crazy you know like it's not really uh yeah it doesn't it's not really amazing or anything like i wish there was something something else it's a little bit like how would i say troppo banale like uh trivial like it's like i don't know but uh, the device looks super good i mean i'm like just they're one of the first manufacturers they're always pushing the whole hey we have a 5g but devices like a lot of other guys big companies they get lost they think that like you know they're inside the company everybody knows that this it's a 5g device so they're like oh you know that we don't really need to highlight that and it's like oh yeah no you do need to highlight that actually you know absolutely you need to highlight that so um that has been uh that's definitely like something nokia did well you know even even just having it into the branding like super super important to uh, to to do that so that that's really well done i love the color the color just looks fantastic i will literally buy this device just for just for the color uh and having a 4k device for sure i mean it, it just like i think they've done a fantastic job about uh you know placing this in the high end it looks high end it just the the and the, i mean personally they hit it out of the ballpark when they had the the speed test because literally you can ask anybody like the one thing i'm always asking is like what's your speed test what's your speed test what's your speed test so it's like i'm crazy about speed testing like i always have people check their speed test because it's just like so important also for our work we're doing um you know we're selling software doing more and more live streaming um uh, so the speed internet speed is just incredible so that that was something that really really got me as a consumer and i was like okay i want to have the like device that has the fastest 5g speed like if they were able to optimize that that's that's amazing you know so that was really really good and uh what else mm, i mean to be honest yeah like i'm, I'm not sure like the two too many like you know the iphone has got iphone 10 and then you got iphone sc and it's like so much easier for a consumer to just know that there's like those two and that's it right and whenever you you're starting to ask like oh hey like uh, this and that it's just become so much harder like 2.2 2.3 three device and, and it of course as you're working in nokia hmd you talk about all these different series as if it's like you know standard and you know there's like no surprise there but that's that's not how it is you know it's like uh it's like it's extremely complicated to to outside users to have to deal with like a lot of different numbers you know like i'm so as a consumer i start to look at all these numbers and i'm like which one should i get you know it's like so many questions and i i don't even know um so yeah those were some of my thoughts like i would have done like like uh basically like like iphone did you know like just just again cop copy them they're the freaking best you know they're just, just you can't beat them you know don't reinvent the wheel 
Nokia, when I was in Nokia, we had a huge portfolio with like all these different series, all these different devices, but we were a much bigger company, you know? So now if that's obviously HMD, it's not in that same situation, uh, they really shouldn't go and like uh, complicate their, their their branding more than more than it's needed, I would say. Um, so I don't know. Um, I would simplify, simplify and make it, make it, make the presentation a little bit prettier, like in terms of some drone action, there's still, there's some offices you can still show. I know it's a, big, it's a small company, but yeah. Um, and the other thing, like, I mean, I've, I bought this, I'll tell you my story about this Lenovo that I got that I'm actually streaming from. I finally decided to move to, move back to PC because, uh, and I'm looking up here because I'm, I'm doing some work meanwhile. Uh, actually finish up uh, a contract and uh, oh god I'm not, like dealing with PC it's, it's a mess <laughs> oh my god you have no idea you have no idea how tough it is for a Mac guy to move to a PC like it, it's like Mac it is like so much better I'm talking about like miles better like it's just it's not even funny I swear um, let me see. I actually think I know how to do it now. Uh, cool. I managed to get it done, but I basically, I was moving around windows and I, and I, I got stuck. I had like nowhere else to go. Um, especially the expose part, but yeah, this was like a good segue to basically tell you about how, how tough it is for somebody after so many years of using Mac, uh, you know, move to what the hell? There you go. Oh wait, it's very hard to move to PC, but I did it because I wanted to get more into live streaming. I wanted to get more into gaming, uh, and actually, I've been kind of very happy that I that I did that. You know, it's been like like it's 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 a great device. It's a great hardware, and just like I'm sure Nokia, it's a great hardware, but. The, it took me so long. I, I spoke to this guy at Lenovo who became my friend for like 10 hours overall. Like, because I had to understand all these different X series and T series. And of course, I'm a geek. You know, I used to make, I used to work just like Yuho is like a product manager. That's kind of, we were pretty much uh, at a similar time there in Nokia. And it's like, you know, um, oh, okay, cool. It's, um, it's easy when you're inside of a big company to say like, hey, you know, uh, yeah, we only have like four or five series. And then you're like a consumer outside and you're inundated with information and you, know, you have to choose between all the different companies. And you end up choosing like whatever is the easiest thing to do, like by far, you know, you want to like simplify your life big time. Want to simplify, simplify, simplify. Um, and so I would say that there's, 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 that's the one thing that I would, kind of strongly encourage the Nokia folks to the HMD folks now to, to, to think about, you know, if there's any way they can just like avoid too many series, it's like call that. So if this is called the Nokia 8, 8, 8.3, like it's already a lot to like, remember eight, like the 8.3 5G, just eight, Nokia 8, 5G, you know what I mean? Um, it's already a lot. You're giving two numbers and you want to add a third number, like the decimal, like, no, remove that, remove that, you know? Um, and again, I'm saying this, this is like, might sound like, oh, this guy's like complaining so much. I'm like, no, I, I love Nokia. I love Yuho. I have very good memories of him in San Diego. Like I was there in that office for like five years, I guess, for five years, five years. It was some great times, you know? And like, he's definitely turned out to be an, a, a great leader. Um, I'm very happy for his progress there, Nokia, but, uh, yeah, it's just like stuff that sometimes it's like, of course, it's so much easier to just, you know, sit here, watch a stream and, uh, and talk about it. Of course, the, the tough part is to actually get the job done, which is, which has been a, a massive undertaking, I'm sure to get this done. But, but yeah, that's, that's the advantage of when you're like outside of the loop for a bit, you know, you, I'm just. I have no bias. I don't have as much bias. I have almost like zero bias, I guess, right now. So, um, what do you think about this uh, this Nokia this Nokia events? Like, uh, what do you think about this Nokia 
announcements. I mean, I'm definitely, I want to go and see, like, oh, there's still a sign-up. But, I mean, I thought they said it's ready to go. So I would not lose the opportunity to sell right now. Like, if you just said on the announcement, make it available right now. Uh, but again, like, uh, how would I say? Uh, how would I say? I mean, of course, it's like, it's not my thing. There's, there's not much that I can do, right? Uh, so... I think that's it. I'm gonna go go finish. Uh, I'm gonna go finish this, and uh, at least I I was able to watch it. I was able to share some thoughts, and I must say it's like, especially when you're I'm doing some work that it's like doesn't require my full brain power because I was just translating a an agreement with Google Translate and sending it over. That's it's. Uh, uh, I'm gonna trust Google on this, just like Nokia's trusting Google. Um. Yeah, those were those were just some of my thoughts, but man, I I'm just like I'm dying to like get a 5G device and to, like, test the speed. And the the other thing, okay, here's the feedback of this like Xiaomi Android One device. You know, it's actually like nice color and everything, but it was like 180 euros device. How much? You know, how much? Nokia 8.3 5G. Um, I guess, uh, oh God, I hate it. It's not available yet. So it seems like it's, uh, gonna go at, uh, 640 or something. One plus is the best, you say. Uh, Abinia, thanks a lot for, for commenting. He's like a newly found friend on YouTube. Uh, I'm starting to do this uh, more unboxing of, of devices and uh, finding some new friends to talk about technology. It's actually been like quite fun, quite interesting. So the 128, it's already, it seems like it's already available on the... Um, 12th of December? On Amazon, it's going to be available on the 12th of December. Oh God, I can't wait that long. I'm believe, um, I am gonna reach out to some of the guys and be like, hey, I'll, I'll give you a review. Um, I cannot, just like any other kind of person, I'm not, I cannot promise to give like a great review. I'll definitely try to keep it, um, I'll definitely keep it as unbiased as possible, but I, I'm also sure that a lot of my kind of Nokia love is gonna come out and I'm gonna find a lot of good things to be excited about. Uh, but I really would like to review this as soon as possible. Oh my God. Um, oh, hopefully you didn't get mad about the, the joke about the Finnish accent. I freaking love the Finnish accent. I can actually I can make a joke about uh, a Finnish joke, one of my favorite ones. <laughs> so there's this Finnish couple, and the lady goes like, "Miko, we have been married for twenty years, and you never you never told me again that you love me." And <laughs> Miko is saying to Yana, I told you, I love you 20 years ago when, when we married. And if anything changes, I will let you know. <laughs> it's like, cause like the Finns are generally like, they, they're pretty cool people, you know, they're actually, they're like, they're so full of love. They're so great. They're so happy there, but they just don't show it as much, you know? So, um, they're not as talkative as us Italians. They don't need to hug they don't like to hug they want to keep their space and stuff like that like so that's kind of like how the fins are but this was oh and there's another really good joke i don't know if i can say it here well who cares like uh maybe for the next time i'll keep this for next time it's between finnish and swedish uh <laughs> it's to practice my finnish accent i probably should do it a few times so like um Still trying to figure out if I can go play tennis, but look, seems like it's not gonna be possible. Oh, there you go. I'm gonna give it a call actually. Um, oh my god. So basically, there's a bunch of uh, Finnish guys in a. Uh, trying to move to the other screen and I can't get it done.
So basically, there's a bunch of Finnish guys in a sauna, and uh, no, yeah, there's a bunch of Finnish guys in a sauna, and they're just drinking there for like hours, you know, without saying anything. And then a Swedish guy comes in, and after half an hour, you know, he was silent for half an hour. After half an hour, he grabs a beer, and he says, "Skull." <laughs> and the Finnish guys go like, "Are we going to drink or are we going to talk?" Actually, yeah, there were no bad words in here. I was, the first time I heard this joke, I was laughing hysterically. Because, um, because as an Italian, I would have gone in there and without even waiting a minute, and in, in the first second, I would have gone like, oh, hi, like shaking hands, I'm Vincenzo, I'm here, I'm dead. <laughs> like, what's your name? What do you guys do? Blah, blah, blah. Like, you know, that was like so funny to me. I was like, oh my God, I would have like, just yeah like shocked these guys out um and that's why it was very 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 funny to me very very funny um but yeah like those were my finished jokes those were my thoughts about nokia and the nokia announcement so actually i sorry i'm finally seeing your message the think band x1 extreme it wasn't crashing now for a bit, but I was still like, like, shocked about those crashes. So about like, you know, the whole PC thing I, that I bought it was so hard to buy. But even and I bought this X1 Extreme, 64 gigabytes, uh, you know, i7 10th generation, like really good device. But it just had like a, a ton of crashes. So I yes, I am returning it. I spoke to Lenovo today, so that um, finishing up the process still too big of to big of a problem of a process and again they they use the similar like outside company for their uh, for their e-commerce and that's the same thing i would say to nokia like as soon as you have enough mass and scale like keep the e-commerce part inside of the company because frankly it's like where where apple shines you know by having everything integrated especially with the sales part and you know i always had like a much better experience like uh, buying and, and no like apple devices of course like i said i couldn't buy a nokia device i was trying to buy it twice i spoke to people in the company i mean for me i'm i'm pretty disappointed because you know out of 20 people i tagged no one even like said hey you know what like uh we're gonna help you out just just talk to this person and you know they'll sort it out and let me know when it's done like or i mean I, as a Nokia guy, I would have been like, oh, here's a device, but I'm, I was not pushing for it. That's probably what they, why they thought so. I actually, like, literally wanted to buy and, and sustain the company, but it's like, yeah, it's, uh, uh, whatever, like, uh, so anyways, let's see, hopefully I'm able to finally buy this device. Uh, I really hope I don't have to wait till December, because actually I need to buy a new Android ASAP, like, I... Kind of my Android situation is it's subpar like this. Xiaomi, uh, it's not really keeping me super happy to be honest. I must be completely honest, completely honest. So Abi, uh, going back to laptop, I'm gonna probably buy a same device. I had the Italian keyboard and I had OLED, and I said let me just hope that it was OLED and Italian keyboard. I'm gonna get the English keyboard so that hopefully. Lenovo produces more of them and you know they won't have any issues and I'm gonna remove the OLED stuff because maybe OLED like creates some more complications and I'm gonna go for an IPS which is supposedly better battery more resistant as well so it's like um, you know so I'm gonna give Lenovo another shot and that's how it is actually I'm and I'm giving another shot so here's what I at least suggest Nokia I'm gonna give Lenovo another shot because there was a guy that I basically became friends with, that spent so much time with me, helping me out, making sure everything was fine. He's like a sales guy on the phone, right? And um, yeah, he's just been amazing, man. Like this guy, like he's, but he's based in Barcelona. He's not based in Milan. I'll, I'll be frank, people in Milan are like quite, uh, and they don't have the kind of friendship type of, uh, the, the, the ability to develop some friendship. This guy I'm speaking to is like French, Spanish is like totally cool. He speaks Italian as well, so he's like a total, like uh, owns it owns it so anyways i'm gonna finish the live off right here i was talking for like 44 minutes i also need to make a call because i i want to check if there's any way i could still end up playing tennis today actually with my dad those are some of the perks of uh 
of being back here where I was born. Um, but yeah, let me know if you have any last minute questions, especially for Abinia conscience abinia where are you from tell me about you i need to you've been like super kind to like uh comment about i wish the hinge is in is in is too in type so that we can even rotate backwards oh yeah yeah, yeah. i know what you mean yeah yeah like like a yoga but then there will be a yoga and that's why they want to sell the yoga and then basically abinia what happens since i was building these devices when i, when I was okay what happens is that um you know like they say no that's kind of how our our device works like that like the yoga guys are like no you know like you you can't do that because we 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 have the yoga type of opening up you know so that, that's why uh ah, okay you're from india uh cool pleasure meeting you uh we'll definitely keep keep chatting about technology and stuff we are uh, both extremely passionate and yeah let me know if you have any other questions because i'm just about to to leave and by the way for my friends watching on linkedin or or he's actually showing the stuff on uh he, he's writing me on um mm, 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 mm. he's writing me on youtube and i was just thinking like if there is any way i could show the comments from restream to like to, to could i show the comments on the live but no because the comments are so, because I'm a stream, I'm streaming from Streamlabs, and so unless Streamlabs is tied to all of those other guys, I'm not getting the the comments, and I can't really show them up. So, anyways, um, so Binya, let me know if you have any last minute questions. Otherwise, I'm gonna make a move and uh, finish up some work and stuff like that. I need to focus on finishing finishing up one thing. I need to make a quick call. Otherwise, it was uh, good to go back live. It's um, definitely enjoying like uh, doing more of these like reviews. Uh, good luck to the Nokia guys and the HMD folks. Uh, again, I would simplify, do some drones, uh, remove some decimals from your model phone numbers get your e-commerce inside of the company so it becomes an asset and unique selling proposition like you you also want to basically my issue with buying because i ended up buying with digital river on uh the, the lenovo so i had the exact i basically bought lenovo via digital river and they worked much better than digital river plus nokia whatever hmd but you know the best is like apple you know you actually have the apple app you guys own my data as a customer i don't have to interact with two separate companies like I, and I know you're supposed to be selling a lot more through Amazon and so on, but I I think you would sell a lot more. Now that you had 230 million in funding, like I would invest a couple of millions at least on creating an amazing e-commerce. I mean, and if you would play the cards right, you could get some amazing developers to create something amazing. And there's a lot of pre-existing e-commerce stuff that you can that you can use. Like I don't really see why you should utilize a third company, which it makes it super hard to like. Um, you know, have a direct touch with the consumer. Like you want to have that direct touch with the consumer. It's, you gotta be a consumer-centric company. You know, look at what Amazon has done. You know, just so you, you gotta be set up for the future, especially have, as soon as you have enough investments. iPhone, I hate App Store monopoly. We have to pay for everything. Ah, yeah, you're of course you're probably one of those really techy person that has an Android and you know is able to crack everything up. Uh, I I've been using iPhone and Android now for a while and I'm still like yeah no you can't side load APKs like Android you can jailbreak the iPhone it's like too much of a pain but uh, for me the iPhone always works out better like the quality I can get on iPhone in terms of this and actually yeah I was excited about the AirPods type of product even though I didn't really like the circular shape I think it's cool with somebody is able to notice your headsets and maybe I, I wish there was a big Nokia in there. I, I think there is, and that, that's cool. And I'm gonna compare as soon as I get my Nokia device. I'm gonna compare the quality of like an iPhone, which I'm looking to buy the new one, the 5G, and I'll compare the speed to the new Nokia 5G device plus with their with their kind of AirPods. And I hope that they make this kind of noise because I literally would like to keep buying this AirPods just because of the noise they make. It just feels so freaking good. Um. I like Armex. We get everything for free. I hope even iPhone apps get pirated. Uh, I'm not very much about software piracy, so I'm not going to disagree with that. 
Abinha, my friend, my new friend on YouTube. I, I started to get a f like first like crossing the 30 subscribers mark. Um, but yeah, like I said already for some time, I'm gonna close this off. It's always so hard to close off. I, I, I love being live and especially even if there's like one person commenting, I'm just having f a lot more fun. And um, gonna say hi to the to the friends, to everybody that I watched either live or will watch this later. As always, always happy to uh, host some people and have some discussions. Um, I actually need to learn how to do the best. Like, what's the best way to s go live and have more people at the same time? Is it through a Skype call? Mm, is it through a Zoom? Probably. Um, it's like I'm still studying the whole live stream market and trying to figure it out. But anyways. Thanks so much for watching. 50 minutes and we're done. I'm going to make a call, see if I can play some tennis. That would be great for my brain and my heart and my soul. Mensana and Corpore Sano. Take care, everybody. Talk to you 